Hi there, my name is Oolabi Tangod, aka MC Oolu, or Oolu for short, and I make going to school easy for you. As a beginner or fresh admission seeker, you may want to know the differences between BSc, HND, OND, NCE, and A level. It is expedient to know this not only for conversation reasons, but also for you to get the real meaning of each, what they stand for, what forms the admissions take. The purpose behind each of them, and most importantly, for you to know which one to go for. Now let's begin with BSc with some other sister names as BSc ED, BSN, BTEC, MB, LLB, BR Greek, and BFAM. In full, BSc is Bachelor of Science. This term is used for a degree or university award. You end BSc after completing a four-year or five-year course in any university. More so, terms like BTEC, BSc, ED are the equivalents to BSc. There are also degree awards, just a difference in courses or discipline. While BTEC is for graduates of engineering and technology-related courses, BSc, ED or BSc, Edu is for graduates of educational courses. Graduates of law are awarded LLB and medical graduates MB. Others include BSN for nursing graduates. B farm for pharmacy graduates, B agric for agriculture and related courses. Now let's see what it means to gain admission to these degrees. Generally, to gain admission into any Nigerian university, you'll have to make your way through Jambi TME, which is a major requirement to gain admission to any course of your interest together with the right SSE grades. After passing UTME, you may be subjected to pursuit TME or admission screening before you can be given admission by Jam and the proposed institution. Your years or duration of studies depend on the prospective award. Majority of degree courses last 4 years, agri courses 5 years, nursing 5 years, medicine 6 years, education 4 years, law 6 years with 1 year law school, pharmacy 6 years with 1 year internship, engineering and technology 5 years which is usually 6 months, IT and so on. Note that gaining admission into any of the courses listed and more may also be preceded with one year pre degree course or sometimes A level advanced courses like IGMB, JPEG, and Cambridge A level. After completing these advanced programs, you can then take UTME, if pre degree or direct entry form, if IGMB, JPEG, or Cambridge A level. Through this, you are offered admission into any university course of your choice. Now, let's talk about Nigerian Certificate in Education NCE. But before we continue, please take two seconds to give this video a like as well as subscribe to this channel for free right now. Thanks and let's continue. NCE is award given to graduates of colleges of education. Generally, after a three-year course at a college, this graduate is awarded NCE. Admission procedures to colleges are the same as for the universities. You write your UTME and take part in the post UTME or admission screening. Then, you are offered admission for your proposed course by JAM and the college. A graduate of college can end up spending four years on his course if he has undertaken a year pre-NCE course before 100 level admission. After completing your NCE, you may continue to a university of your choice through the JAM direct entry admission exercise. Here you obtain direct entry form and choose one or two universities you are interested in. If you meet up with the required grade from your NCE program, JAM and the school will offer you admission. Meanwhile, as an NCE holder, you don't just choose any course during your DE registration. You choose the ones that align with your completed NCE course. For example, if you study biology and chemistry in college, you may only be able to propose education biology or chemistry education. Completing this will award you BSc, Edu, BED, or BED. A few schools may allow you to do pure courses like chemistry or biology, which will award you BSc at the completion. Consider checking the jam broker for the specific requirement by universities. Generally, it will be easier to gain admission to educational courses. With that cleared, let's now head over to Ordinary National Diploma OND or National Diploma ND for short. You may want to ask, what is the meaning of OND? OND or ND is a polytechnic award for a two-year course with which the order can be employed or be offered admission into higher National Diploma HND and where through direct entry admission be admitted to 200 level course in any university. To gain admission for the ND award, you must obtain the JAMB TME form and take part in the post TME or admission screening of the school. 
If you pass, you'll be offered admission to the ND1 of your proposed course by JAM and the school. Another means to gain ND admission is through school administered daily part time programs. This course is usually run as full time, perhaps with cost difference. Some may also opt in for the three year program called a regular part time course. When you complete your two year or three year ND course at any polytechnic, you are awarded ND. This serves as the prerequisite to further your education at any university through JAM Direct Entry Admission, as we have explained before. You can also further to another level at your polytechnic or any other. This level is called Higher National Diploma Level, HND. HND is also run for two years as well. Whereas it's being proposed that Nigerian Polytechnics will henceforth be limited to the award of ND only. Hence, candidates who wish to study further can obtain the JAM Direct Entry Form and cross to universities where they continue from the 200 level. We have hinted on HND already, but it won't be bad to say more for clarity purpose. HND is award given to a Polytechnic graduate after completing a two-year national diploma or one year or two years industrial training IT and two-year higher national diploma course. Note that the HND course doesn't require writing UTME again or obtaining the JAM direct entry form. Applicants are only to take part in the school's organized entrance test and interview or screening. Well, now let's see A level courses, the likes of IGMB, JUPEB, NAPTEP A level, and Cambridge Advanced Level. The summary of this is that by completing any of the above, it equates you with ND or NCE. Hence, you are qualified to obtain the JAM Direct Entry Form in order to proceed to any university accepting them. I've made comprehensive videos about IGMB and JUPEB, and they are right on this channel. Do well to watch them to see how they work. I believe with this, you have sufficiently known the difference between all these degrees. We will draw the curtain here today. Please do like and subscribe to this channel, as well as share and recommend our channel as the best academic channel for your friends and loved ones. My name has never changed and will never change. I remain my humble self, Owola Bitangod, aka MC Owo Blue. Follow me on all social media platforms on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter at MC underscore Owo Blue. Pay attention to our weekly news roundup featuring all academic news for the past week that you might have missed. Till I come away again, bye bye.